Yup, it's time to rise and shine baby. Ooh, I'm gonna need a shave. Well, now it's time to head to work. Oh shoot, I'm late for work. It seems that today's flight is gonna be a short one. Hopefully I can meet up with the guys when I'm back. Hi Chris, you want to meet before I perform? What is it? Yes, the booms, DJ Yums. You see, talent is so very rare and when you find it raw, you mustn't waste time. What is the point Chris? Well, we have a new singer by the name of Stacy. You two have to get close so we see a nice well cooperated duo sing. What? Why? I already am in the duo, the Yums brothers. That other guy left to be an officer. This is a deal of a lifetime. Please, do it for Chris White. Fine, great now I have to perform with some ugly woman. Hey. Well hello there. I thought you said I was ugly. Well actions speak louder than words, don't they? What does that mean? Michael, Tobias is dying he needs to take his pills now. Trust me, I know physics. His body doesn't have enough mass to give out like that. This is a biological job Michael, he will die if we don't give him the pills. Let me explain. Tobias' body is aged. With the amount of expanding pills we're giving him, his mass isn't enough to take in that amount. So his stomach will burst if we give him pills, but without pills he would be. Okay. That's actually pretty smart. Perhaps if we combine our biological and physical intellect we can be the best doctors ever. Best of all, we would do it together. Now let's go save lives Kate. Good morning passengers and welcome to flight B427. Yeah, um, hi, our current altitude is 100,000 miles in the air? Vic, how did this happen? I don't know. Stella, can you hear me? Calm down our first class section celebrities bobbing Renegade Raider. Renegade what's going on? Are we going to die? I've been in an acid storm before I'm not scared of a little altitude. Hello Bob, I can see that you're worried. It's no problem, just calm down and we will soon arrive. Uh, okay, sure, thanks. Renegade Raider. Shut up or I'll 180 the scope you. Gee, fine. Hello Tobias, how are you feeling now? I feel okay, except my arm is dislocated, can you help? Sure. Thanks. Alright. Tobias' vitals are stable, and his heart and lungs are fully functioning. So when are we looking at releasing him? Due to his current state, he can break his arm just by having a handshake. He needs titanium plates installed. But, then we'd be making him a superhuman. I know, none of us have any expertise on how to manage titanium plates. But I know a guy. Did you have to hitch a ride? What? Aren't we supposed to be close? I'm sorry but you called me ugly, you didn't even know me and judged me. I loved you but, you didn't even want to do oh before you met me. Stacy I. No, it's enough, you've done enough, get out. Oh, Stacy. All I had to do was just be nice for once. I couldn't even just accept the new partner without a fight. How do I pull things back together from here now? This isn't how I expected today to go. I'm sorry Stacy. I can't tell Chris I'm done for. He really wanted this. But Ibuz was a jerk. Or did I overreact? He's a nice guy. Oh but he thinks I hate him now. How do I tell him that I didn't mean for anything I did? I'm so terrible. I'm sorry Ibuz. Hi Stella, I'm so happy we could meet up. Sure, so what is it? Well, I've been thinking about taking a leave, you know, getting away from the constant thought that I would crash a plane. Victor. Well what I'm saying is... I'm with you on this. Thanks Stella, 
hear the best. Don't worry about it. Hey Mike, what's up? I need you help with something, Kobe. What is it? I have a plan. One of my patients need titanium implants, so we might need you know who. Him. What do you mean Abuz doesn't want to perform? I'm sorry. I can't even find him. I think maybe he... Stacy. Abuz? Stacy, I'm sorry. I didn't think before being rude to you. I'm sorry. I don't deserve you. Abuz, I was gonna say the same. I just overreacted. I'm sorry too. Let's just end this fight and move on. Together. Together.